Explaining the 17 Goals for 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Development. Let's explain how do the medicines animals receive affect human health. Most of the animals we eat are given antibiotics to increase food production. When we eat these animals, we are also taking in the harmful chemicals used to fatten the animals up. It becomes a public health issue when antibiotics that are important for human health are given to animals on a massive scale. This act encourages the growth of drug-resistant bacteria that can lead to diseases being progressively harder to treat. However, there is a solution to this issue. Animals like humans need antibiotics to help their bodies fight or prevent certain types of infections. It is the overuse of these antibiotics that causes the animals to gain weight and fills them with the chemicals that are harmful for us to ingest. The FDA has taken note of this and implemented a policy that regulates how much medicine animals receive and a process to ensure that they are monitored by veterinarians. Making sure you buy your meat from your local deli or farmer's market is a great way to avoid eating animals that have been fattened up for consumption. Switching to a vegetarian or vegan diet can also ensure that your body doesn't fall harm from the drugs being pumped into livestock. These healthy alternatives not only affect your body, but the environment as well. Raising animals for food creates more greenhouse gas emissions than cars and planes. 30% of the Earth's landmass is dedicated to raising animals for food. This includes the land used for grazing and growing feed crops. Changing your eating habits can help to save all the land that we currently use for cattle pastures, which consists of 80% of the Amazon. Together, we can all do our part to make sure our food is healthy and the animals we get it from are too.